coming right? Are you coming in love? Are you coming to me? Are you coming to me in love? If you're not, get the fuck away from my car because I ain't with you. You're not coming to me at all. It's not my place. It's not your place. Really? A woman needs to know her place. Really? God created woman for man. When you second day two, and he made that one for your life. Better, right. But women they need to know the role. They need doesn't you know, you don't even know what time is a woman does not get a woman does not get in a man's face. If you have a man, your man can come talk to me. Do you have a man? You are the most pathetic human being. I'm pathetic, really? Oh yeah. Are you a lesbian? Reason why? Why would you care anyway? I'm not here for you. That's on Jesus. That's on Jesus. That's on Jesus. Oh, really? Don't preach to me. You know his mission? Don't get away from me. You don't have a Bible with you? Do I have a Bible with me? Do you want one? I'll give you one. Here comes a woman right now to tell you to leave. Do I have a Bible? Yes, I do. Okay, one? so do you even know it? It's not the woman cracked. Oh, really? Where is in there does it tell me that I need to know my place? This gentleman right here, here and possibly this Okay, okay, okay we understand that, but y'all have a permit on the outside of the gate, not inside the police venue. Yeah. You got a permit to, to demonstrate, correct? Actually, you don't right, need a permit. You need a permit with an amplification. And if you do, if you tell me that we're going to go to jail, I have a video recording right here, and, and I'll leave if you say so, but I'm going to take it to court. So will we go to jail if we keep using our First Amendment right? That's what I want to know. This is a protected area, like she said. Yeah. Anyway, Actually, the this is um, speaking this right is now. supposed this to be a okay. no, Yes, this is a really. Yeah, yeah, really. It is. And however, however. Yeah. Our city ordinance says two or more people, y'all are two. Yes. That is a demonstration, okay? Okay? That's what our city ordinance said. And I've already talked to the legal department, to and the they pastor. told me, and they told me that y'all are more than welcome outside the gates, but this is a leased property from Central Alabama Pride. You can come in, you can be a patron, you can enjoy the festivities all day long. But once you start upsetting the people in here, then it's got to stop. Can I ask you We're something? We're here in peace. Um, sincerely, will you take us to jail for using our First Amendment right right here? I, I need to know that for my re reporting. Sir, sir. Because I need to know that because I'm, I have a person that's going to give me a free to, free speech What lawyer. they're saying, though, what they're and, saying. And it's awesome, man. I, will take I love free, I will take, man. That's cool. I will take oh, well, I think they're saying, the law. Yeah. 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 What I think she's yeah. saying, though, is they actually, like, basically, yeah. Like, yeah. Yeah. rented this land. They're paying. Yes, they're paying. Right, that's right. what they they're do paying. in Atlanta, too. I've been to Atlanta Pride Festival. They lease awesome. it. So this is considered no free speech, though, right? As long as we don't use amplification. It's leased by Central Alabama Pride. So it's a no free speech, though, then, basically. I'm not telling you you don't have free speech. Yeah. I'm not arguing the Constitution yeah. with you guys, okay? Everybody's just trying to come out here and have a good time. Yeah, I understand. That's it. That's it. Yeah. Without being something pushed on them. Yeah. But okay. like, but like this agenda is being pushed on us. Why is it being pushed on you? Really? You Everywhere you go, it's in our face. If we, if we don't accept it, hey, hey, no, 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 I'm talking to the cops. If we don't accept it, we're considered bigots because we're going by what the Bible says. Are you cops Christians? I'm sure some of you got a personal opinion has nothing to do with it. No, no, no. The, the Bible is not an opinion. The Bible is not an opinion. It's not a personal opinion. We go by what the Word of God says. Because ultimately, God is our judge. He's our jury. Sorry about that. That's, that's my point. We go with the Word of God says. And this is being forced on us. This is being forced on Christians. No, is anybody forcing you to be here right now? No, we're coming out. And we're, my case we're, in point. Yeah, um, oh, really? No one is forcing you to be here. Be and supporting you sin. Uh, no, this agenda is being forced on us, and like we can't go agenda. anywhere without being considered hateful bigots. This is bigots. what we got right now. Yeah, y'all are. Yeah, I understand. Doing this. And I've been to so, more chaotic stuff than that. And so, I mean, whether people like it or not, you know, I still share the gospel a lot of times. And I really wasn't going over there to a lot of them. They actually came over to here to right. us. They came to us. You we know, were I talking to two people. To this uh, other guy who claimed to be a bishop. See, there's a difference between being a mm -hmm. saying claiming to be a bishop and supporting sin. That's that's what I went over there for to um, give him what the Bible says about being a bishop. You know, it says you know he can't be a bishop and a Christian. And when you and call the demons sin. out, the demons rile you know, up. Like that's why that's, that woman bucked up and got in my face. And that's why we have the camera. As soon as she put her hands on me, as soon as she put her hands on me, she was going to jail. He said, as long as we don't have amplification, that we can be here. You know, Natasha, right? The one that's over the um, permits. Natasha Pettis. Yeah, yes, I, I already talked to her. And um, she said, you don't use amplification, you can. So I can't. So, I mean, unless you're going to take us to jail. You got her on speed dial? You want to call her for me so I can talk to her? I have her on my email. Mm -hmm. Show her the email. 
Uh, I, I have the I same know. email. I have yeah. the exact same email. Yeah. That said, y'all would be given permission to be outside the leased area. Yeah, I, I already t talked to her. I mean, mm -hmm. she she said in here you need amplification. You can't use uh, amplification in here without a permit. I mean, that's why I'm asking you whether or not we're going to go to jail or not. Because if did I ever say you were no, going no, to jail? Not. Did I'm, I ever say no, you were going I'm to jail? No, I'm just asking. Jail never came yeah. out of my mouth. Yeah, I know. Just now. And I'm we're, just asking you. We're more worried about what's going on outside of the state. Okay, we're trying to make sure. We're worried about, yeah. about people getting killed in Orlando. That, that's not going to happen. Okay. And take How do you know that? Because that's a hoax. That's How do you false know that? flag attack. You ever heard of false flags? That's a false flag to put fear in people. No, but guess what? God didn't give us the spirit of fear. He gave us the power, love, and of a sound mind. That's fear. They're putting fear in the hearts of people, thinking, oh my gosh, now every gay event that's going to happen, there's going to be a murder taking place. No. That's fear. That's propaganda. That's media propaganda. Okay. Well, I have no control over media propaganda. But you're believing it. You're falling for it. You're saying, oh my gosh, we're worried that that's going to yeah, happen. We're, we're not here that's not going to happen here. And stuff like that. We don't yeah, wrestle um, against flesh and blood, yeah, but against principalities, powers, the rules yeah. of darkness of this world, and spiritual they wickedness they in high places. In, That's what's know, going on. They're, they're putting fear in people's minds. But if you're a Christian, and I'm sure you might be, ma'am, if you're a Christian, you're not going to fall for that. Why would you, you know, fall um, for that media propaganda saying, oh my gosh, all these people got murdered? No, that's a bunch of hooey. That's a false flag attack. Just like 9-11 was a false flag. Oh, wow. Okay. Just like Sandy Hook was a false well, flag. Okay. You know, conspiracy theories. It's not right. a conspiracy theory. Okay. It's not a conspiracy oh. theory. We're more worried right. about the, yeah. the event going We're on worried about not people what's going on out here. Yeah. So y'all please and people don't not yeah. any more being goaded into some type of interaction with you guys. Okay? Okay? Hey, they I'm got goaded on. That's them. We, we, the yeah, conversation we were having with two gentlemen. With us. Okay. Well, so-called gentlemen. We but okay. at all. Well, you know, we, we, I was just sharing, you know, with this guy who, who was making a video. I asked him what he was making a video for. Because he claimed to be a Lord, hallelujah. You know, Thank actually you, Jesus. show a lot of mercy to people who are homosexuals and stuff. Because I used to be very wicked, you know. But I went to a guy who, who said he was a bishop, but he said homosexuality was okay. I have a problem with that. I don't have a problem with someone who's. Because you're leading people to hell. You're, you're hugging people right into hell. This is, this is you know, a, this that's, is that's the only reason I went over there to him. And th they got rowdy, you know. I was just sharing the gospel. You know, what the Bible says. Maybe they sense. took it as you were trying to judge them. Okay? Yeah, well, Jesus well, the Bible says judge righteous, righteous judgment. judgment. You know, I, I was just it's actually not your making, place to judge. I was making no, righteous judgment. Jesus says on judge the righteous God judgment. Because, um, so it says, it says don't judge hypocritically. It says don't judge hypocritically. But see, that's what happens when people don't know the word of God. See, we actually know the word of God and we stand on the word of God. It says make righteous judgment. And they flee. When you give them the word of God, they flee. Give them the word of God. When, 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 when Satan came against, hey, get this on video. When Satan came against Jesus, when he tempted him, when he came against Jesus, guess what happened? He came with him with the false word, and Jesus came with the true word of God, Amen. and Satan fle fleed. Mm -hmm. Submit yourselves, hey. therefore, to God. Resist the devil, and he will flee. Amen. All right. Resist the devil, and he'll flee. Did you 